free Mako stuff. Can't beat that. It's like a sore Peter. Can't beat it. Uh, what's up, guys? CP the Tool Addict. Woo! We've got the Flyer 19 from Matco. Matco Tools. Best hex torque socket on the market. <laughs> That's subjective. Uh, I believe they believe that. Do you believe that? Let me know in the comment box down below. Anyways, let's check out. This is very uh, blue pointish looking. It's a 75 piece set. It's $423. I'll bet you dollars to donuts. I can go to Capri, find that same set for about a fourth. Yes, that's right. I said one fourth of that cost. Should we look? Let's take a peek real quick. Okay, so I was wrong on the price, but S2 steel, I trust in the Capri socket, so that's the reason why I tell you, but this is quarter three, it's half inch set, and this is an 88 piece set, all for the low, low price of $199, where's the price here, it stink, there it is, $199, you guys should have said something, that's going down, so, it's half the price, now, that's up to you, whether or not you choose that or not. I'm not saying the ADV set's bad, actually. Uh, that's not the deal here at all. But pretty interesting uh, to see, you know, what's this here? Review and win. Interesting. We're going to look at this on page 8. This is going to be interesting. Let's move right along here and talk about what we have here on this deal. We got the portable swivel rechargeable light. Uh... Matco light for $56.95. Looks like that's a 10 watt cob light. What's that? It's got a little digital LED display on the back of it. And it does not give the lumens. I'm sure it does. And somebody's going to say it does. And I'm blind. Oh, there it is. 500. Jesus. Why is it so hard for me to find it? Uh, $56.95 for a uh, 500 lumen light. Yeah, not too bad. That looks a lot like the Mantis one from Clore. Uh, propane micro torch. I'm not a big fan of that. I think I didn't have that one. I had a but I had a butane. I I'm not a fan of the, this stuff. Anyways, I'm not gonna get into that. Lifetime warranted carbide burbits. Now I'm sure these are lifetime because they had the other ones. But 164. These are the high performance cur carbide board. Include shape size. These look like the uh, non ferrous. Are they? No, they're carbide burrs. Cylinder radius for contour fish. Yeah. So they must be just the deeper pocket they look like the big ones on there you know the aluminum non-ferrous ones but eh, whatever rechargeable swivel flood lamp 21450 3750 lumens over there we got another little super form one enough of that one that's uh that's not exciting guys here they are i've got this set i love them i think they work great fantastic they're about these are literally about 90 percent cheaper than the matco mac rbrts and i really haven't had a problem with them now just so you know you can get those for a lot cheaper from astro I'm not sure how the warranty works with that but uh these are lifetime warrantied these do work great uh i would spend 151 dollars on them i have actually i think i gave 100 dollars for them when they first came out inflation fellas 90 percent rounded nut they work great absolutely fantastic digital caliber 7150 we got the hammer piece, five piece hammer set, 215. Cooling refiller adapter. Man, these things have went up in price. Shit you not. I've literally I paid 175 for mine right off the Matco truck, brand new. Now they're up to 243. Done in two to three minutes. They're absolutely time savers. Must haves in almost all the Chryslers. You guys know the strat on that. So trim tools. Six piece mini panel remover. Uh, I'm gonna say get this get the Lyle one. Spend the uh 15 bucks on that and 18 bucks or where we can find it i don't it's pretty much out of stock everywhere uh it's already moved like gangbuster multi-piece lockout kit 132.95 if you haven't seen that video go check it out after this one i did the lyle tool video with the uh new pry bar they come out the aluminum one god that thing is amazing what what do the, those guys just i mean they eat their wheaties that's all there is to it the, this right here Multi-piece lockout. I'd pay $132 for this off the Matco truck. This is an absolute amazing kit. I love this two-piece kit. This is a three-piece now, huh? Yeah, three multi-piece, huh? Maybe I need that one. 
Maybe I need to step up my game to that. That might not be a lock tools technology. It might be a new one, but LTI used to make the one night the big easy. The big easy. <laughs> Two piece mini scraper set. These are kind of nice. They're handy to have if you want to take off emblems quick. Twenty nine fifty. Not not a bad horrible investment. The seal puller with handle, guys. That's an awesome tool to have. I don't know why they're sh showing an input shaft on a transmission pump with that. I don't believe that you can get that seal in there. But forty two ninety five. I might be wrong. I don't do that many transmissions but that's an awesome thing to have trust me love that tool that thing is a lifesaver uh crimper for a super seal 1.5 terminal seals 4250 i know i'm talking a lot here what do we got going on in here the pro max stuff wow they actually got the price on this this is pretty exciting so guys i love this pro max stuff this is uh this is actually awesome stuff very very well built it is extremely expensive no matter what and i'm pretty sure that this is a dealer standard price, so I don't think it matters where you buy this. I don't believe Matco is making a lot on this, I, but I cannot confirm that. I have to look. But this is awesome stuff. Now I don't work on Power Strokes because uh, I'm not a I'm not a diesel guy. I've said this multiple times, and uh, you know I I do I do stuff. I have done stuff. I don't like it. Let's just put it to you that way. I don't like to. I don't go out of my way to. Uh, wheel bearing puller combo. I've seen this in action. This thing is an absolute beast uh ford tommy subaru tommy yeah those are i mean they're expensive don't get me wrong but you're getting an awesome tool they are awesome tools they are worth the money i mean they're expensive but they are manifold bulk repair kits i will say uh, lyle has one for a lot cheaper um these do have a couple of features on them i have not used any of these so i'm not going to go into great detail but they are pricey as you see oh <laughs> uh, we got some oakley's <laughs> Flat jackets, double edges, easy transports, batteries, 759, 402. Uh, yeah, 650, 225 amps. You can't beat having a good battery charger, uh, honestly. Hey, let's just double down on that flyer right there, CP. Moving right along here. We got some more ADB sockets here. The uh, 3H drive, 13-piece metric, 6 point set for 72.95. We have a half-inch drive, 11-piece SAE stubby. Uh, I highly recommend getting the Astros. That's just, I love those. I have the Astro Nanos. Great sockets. They're quite inexpensive. And you get this, you get the ratchet wrench with them. And uh, they're they're out of the world. Once again, uh, I have that video in my archive somewhere. Just search CP the Tool Addict Astro Tools and you will see that. They've been out for a long time. Streamlight, Cyclone Rechargeable. Um, no prices. They're, Matco is an authorized Streamlight dealer. Mayhew quarter inch drive seven piece phillips screw bit sets uh those are kind of handy i should get those but i do have the uh japan wrenches that uh i have that are not not jis but have ones that are uh so i haven't really ever gotten to the point of needing those but those mayhew bits are sweet i love those review and win review any matcotools.com for a chance to win win our monthly Find a Matco product on Matco's website. Scroll to the reviews tab. Write your review. Oh, look at that. So, uh, I don't know if that means good or bad, but uh, winner, one per month. So, if you go to the Matco tool site, review their product, and tell, you, tell them what you think on the Matco tools website, then you can win a tool. So, that's pretty awesome. That's, uh, I mean, hey, that's no, no frills, no chills. I would definitely uh, recommend doing that if for a chance to get some free Matco stuff. Can't beat that. It's like a sore Peter. Can't beat it. Uh, we got a win with Matco, the 4S. Need credit for a career investment, the 4S. Yeah, low weekly payments. Mm -hmm. I recommend just buying your toolbox and getting it paid off. That's, that's your best strategy. Buy tools, guys, if you don't have a... I said this I feel like this is a broken record whenever I say that but buy tools if you don't need a toolbox and you are making decent money then buy a toolbox do not buy a toolbox if you do not have the tools I don't care if you got to carry put them in a paper bag make sure you get all the tools first make the money and then buy them have the money ready to buy a toolbox don't finance it that's just that's just foolish uh never seen before maximus <laughs> I, I should do a video and talk about that, just why you should never buy credit. I I mean, it, 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 is it 
it's we'll get into it later if you want to see that video about credit and me talking about that and telling you i will definitely do it uh maximus thermal imager 1156 that is a rebranded tool i believe that's actually about 500 bucks on amazon you can get it or anywhere else i can't remember the name of it but uh, i'm sure somebody will remind me in there hd scanner with code reader the millennial heavy duty pro code reader 66650 terrible number to use there fellas you screwed up on that one maco we got the power probe 3ez an awesome tool yeah everybody knows that power probes are amazing i do have the snap on one so i prefer it but uh i should get a power probe as a backup just because and i think i might one of these days but uh 246 and 237 for the power probe 3 with case and accessories and then the easy uh the easy's got helps help sections on it but yeah uh update your scan tool stay on warranty tech tip we've got the beast from the east or i guess it's the west that's where Mac. no Actually, Mac is east of me, so yeah. 1675. The Beast from the East, 20 volt Infinium. Hog Daddy. Uh Tortoise Channel did a uh deal on that. It was a beast. It was legit. Uh the Infinium stuff is not that bad. It is kind of pricey for being what I would consider kind of a generic tool truck brand. Uh, because they don't have really any <coughs> clout. I mean, Matco has went through different amounts of uh, uh tools over the years here. Till they finally landed on this but uh yeah 979.95 it is what it is uh three and an eighth tile uh tire inflator 107 the air powered vacuum is just speaking to me 90.95 oh my god the texas twister do not buy this tool oh my god these guys will probably listen to this and these guys are the biggest whiners that own this they have some good, very good products. The company that makes these, uh, and I believe this is Lock Tools Technology, Lock Tools uh, LTI, and I got no disrespect for them, but this thing is a pile of garbage. It, I mean, it, it's just science. It, it maybe it could help you out in like one or two instances in ten years, okay? But it transferring that much force on a rod, it just you're losing power. So, anyways, we're not going to get into that, but uh, I, I I just highly recommend staying away from that. Somebody might come in the comment box and say, hey, that thing saved my life. If you're that one guy with the story, let me know. I would love to hear it. I would love to hear somebody say that it works good, but I have tried it three or four different times, and it sucked, especially taking out um, the CB shaft. This is what the one piece I used, which uh, right, universal flatbed. They used to have a cup deal. It slid in behind the CB shaft, I think. Uh, maybe they don't have it anymore because it broke off. But it, I was trying to pull out a pop out a CB shaft in some in like an Ecotech or something. Anyways, meet your new favorite. Probably not mine. Maybe it's yours. One eighty seven ninety five for the three eighths fifteen inch uh, locking tooth. It's only one hundred eighty seven dollars. I highly recommend if you're looking to get a Matco ratchet, buy it at this price point. I paid nearly three hundred for my black chrome one. Uh, and I am completely disappointed with it. Uh, the overall quality was crap. I've talked about this. Not a fan. Um, 106.50 for a six-piece punch and chisel set. And then we've got the Matco, you know, toys and Antron Brown and shoes and nothing in there that really takes me to deal. Yeah, let's see here. Uh, we've got the Drink Flight screwdriver handled shape. I don't know why they don't put a Matco screwdriver instead of their e Silver Eagle one. Like, nobody likes those screwdrivers. Those things are trash. And then you put that on your your other stuff. It's, like, dumb. Uh, Antron Braun die cast. I used to love... Guys, if you don't know it, I probably... Maybe I should do a video. If anybody wants to see it, but I have over 100 die cast drag cars. I've never talked about this, but I do have 100 die cast. I was a huge die cast fan. I have about 30 John Force die cast cars that are in the box, never touched... I've had them for years. Uh, Matco football, thirty ninety five. I'd like to get that because I have a Mac one. Knife uh, set with wood block, one ninety nine ninety five. So you can stab yourself when you do buy a toolbox on credit. Um, <laughs> Expendents, uh, fifty six ninety five for the. Uh, I'm kidding about stabbing yourself too, guys. That's a joke. Do not do anything to harm yourself or whatnot. If you need help, you know, and you're in any type of depression, you know, reach out to a guy reach out to somebody reach out to me reach out to a friend you know 
somebody, anybody, those people will talk to you. Uh, Matco credit's not worth doing that stuff. Anyways, Pro Charge Wireless Charging Cable System. It's a pretty neat system, $123.95. It's actually not bad priced. I actually might actually entertain buying this because it's got that phone holder and then another flat place so you can charge some of your wireless products. That's actually worth the money, in my opinion. And it's a Matco exclusive. So, no, Matco doesn't make it, but you won't be able to get it from anywhere else. And then all these products charge off of that here. 108 for the Pro Charge Wireless Flashlight. I do have the Snap-on one, and it's I, I do like it. So, yeah, 93.95 Pro Charge Wireless Headlamp. <laughs> Pretty interesting. So, anyways, guys, that's the video for you. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. Ring that bell. Remember, keep your hands dirty. And your money clean. Thanks for watching.